Welcome to Life Journey. I'm so glad you took the time to listen to Life Journey. Don't forget to subscribe to my video where every day I'll be loading revelation that in the Word of God to break it down to tell you about reasons. So 10 reasons why people join cultism movement or cultic movement. 10 reasons why people join cultic movement. Look like the, the Jim Jones situation. All these people been poisoned. The Diva Koresh situation. People have died at the hand of a cultic movement which man saying that he's Christ. And people believe this man. And go to God because they've been duped. They've been bamboozled about an event that will happen in their life. So 10 reasons why people join the cult. And the first reason, they love witchcraft practice for power, for nature. They may lie at the beginning until the end of their life. Yes, they love witchcraft. Witchcraft has become a big phenomenon in the church hey glory to God and in the world because people don't believe in witchcraft they believe it's just magic magic is of God no my friend magic is of the devil number two reason they live a, a spirit influence especially in dreams and vision of the occult thinking they are the mighty one the devil can give them power. Hey, glory to God. I know it's a lot, my friend, but I'm telling you, break it down. They live spiritist life, influenced especially in your dreams and vision of the occult. Amen. They, 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 they want to give you power. Power to for what? Like just like Eve. Eve say the fruit will make one wise. Hallelujah. I've spoken. The ten reason why I am on God doctrines. Everybody want to be like God, not God mean little holy, but being God with power. So the the cultism have crept in. Hey, glory to God! You not a church believer, but you are cult believer. You believe in a cult. You believe in a witch. You believe in supernatural power of witchcraft. Number three, they leave God and go after fables and magical being in their dreams. For they lure into darkness and dungeon of dragon of Satan kingdom, which is evil, but you are so blind of God's presence. Ask yourself this question, is this of God? Amen. And how do you find it? You go to the Bible. Number fifth reason, they are luxurious in relationship, marriage, never prosperous, but divorce, continue to have many relationship, but never settle down for marriage. A cult. A cultic movement. Six, they want liberty, but end up in slavery and oppression. They leave, go to God, God, and become dead in their ignorance. The Bible says, my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. You join the call for power, you end up become powerless and confused and deceived and die. Number seven, they want luck and chance. That's why they get into cultic movement. It's about blessing, not about luck, not about chances, not about the lottery. Number nine, the eighth reason, we lower our standard and open our heart to mess, empty promises, and vainglory. Yes, we, we lower our standard. Number nine, we let legion dominate our lives like a man in a graveyard. They come into our mind to confuse us and use us and dump us and destroy us. We become robots walking away hopeless. 
and tell. We think our life is better, but it turned out to be worse than before. How to get out of the cultic movement? Come to acknowledge that Jesus Christ is Lord and Savior. Ask Jesus into your heart, not into your head. Confess that Jesus Christ died and resurrected from the grave and is alive. Say, Father, thank you for sending your son Jesus to die in, in, in my place. And I'm asking you to come into my life and save me and restore me in the name of Jesus Christ and fill me with the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. That's how you get out of the cultic movement by asking Jesus to come into your life now. Not tomorrow, not next Sunday, but now. Ask him, confess that you is a mess. Confess that you want the devil out of your life now. Ask those little birdies that, that gets into your subconscious. Tell them enough get out in the name of Jesus. Evict the devil out your life now. And my friend, I come against that spirit right now in the name of Jesus. Get out of the cultic movement. Yes, if you are a Jehovah's Witness, you're in a cultic movement. If you are a Seventh-day Adventist, you're in a cultic movement. If you're a Muslim, you're in a cultic movement. If you're if you are Mormons, you're in a cultic movement. If you're Scientology, you're in a cultic movement. Hey, yes, my friend. If you are like Carlton Pearson, you're in a cultic movement. If you don't believe that Jesus Christ is God, you're in a cultic movement. If you only believe that the Bible is authentic, authentic word of God, you're in a cultic movement. If you don't believe in the Holy Ghost as do God, you're in a cultic movement. If you believe the Holy Ghost is a is a liquid and a radar being, you're in a cultic movement. If you believe that that Jesus and Lucifer are brothers, you're in a cultic movement. If you don't believe in a virgin birth, you're in a cultic movement. So I'm telling you, if you don't believe that the church is you, you're in a cultic movement. If you don't believe in heaven and hell, you're in a cultic movement. If you don't believe that you need to be saved, you're in a cultic movement. Hey, glory to God. If you don't believe that you need, you don't need to acknowledge Jesus Christ is, is the savior of your soul, you're in a cultic movement. And if you are acknowledging all of this, if you believe that the movie Hallelujah. Black Panther was no witchcraft. You know, cultic movement. Hey, glory to God. So I'm telling you, my friend, it's time to get out of the cultic movement and get into Christ. Hallelujah. Get into Christ by getting to the word of God. Get on your knees. Acknowledge that Jesus Christ is the savior of the whole universe. If you are, glory to God. Believe there are people that are dressed in purple. The Hebrew lights, you in a cultic movement. Hey, go to God. If you say you don't need to be a Christian, you in a cultic movement. Hallelujah. It's time for us to know the truth. It's time for us to get out of bondage and get into the beautifulness of Jesus Christ. Hey, go to God. Cultic movement is creeping in to the church. Now, you are the church. I'm not talking about a building. I'm talking about individual life. You don't believe in the sorcery. You don't believe in, you believe that magic is good. You're in a cultic movement. Hey, glory to God. Huh? If you don't believe that when you die, you go to heaven, you're in a cultic movement. I know Bob Marley said, preacher man, don't tell me heaven in the sky. Whether heaven is in the sky or heaven is wherever, I believe in heaven is Christ. Hey, glory to God. But cultism is creeping in the culture. Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. And we, as being preachers and, and prophets and apostles and pastors, we got to cry loud and spear not. Lift up that voice like a trumpet and show my 
people their transgression in the house of Jacob their sin. Cultic movement has crept in. And if you become oppressed rather than to be oppressed, you're in a cultic movement. If you call yourself your Holy Ghost filled and you abide, how about glory to God? You're in a cultic movement. And it's time for you to get out of the movement and move with the Holy Spirit, which come to give you life and give it more abundantly. And glory to God. But cultic movement is a phenomenon in the church right now. The 11th hour is not of God, it's of the devil. He go out glory to God. And right now, God says it's time for you to come out of the cultic movement. Because God said He came to set the captive free, delivered. Hallelujah. From bamboozism, from hoodooism, from voodooism. Hey, glory to God. But cultic movement start when you believe the witch is wonderful. You believe wizard. It's glorious. That's a cultic movement. You are believe. Hallelujah. And people, hallelujah, they, they persecuted me for I call Black Panther witchcraft. Cultic movement had crept in unaware. Like a snake in the garden. And you are communicating with a snake. High glory to God. But it's time for you to get out of Scientology. Time for you to get out of Jehovah Witnessing. Time for you to get out of Seven Day Adventist. Time for you to get out of Mormonism. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Get out, church. Get out.